So my guys are making me do this because there's a very important message that needs to come through. Hi guys, <laughs> by the way. Um, I've been avoiding this for a while. Um, in the past, there have been several downloads that I've avoided. They're not letting me off the hook with this one. So yeah, it's definitely not going to resonate for all of you. As always, you do have to use your own discernment as to whether this message is going to be for you or not. Um, but it is, it is important enough although not new, I don't feel like it's new, but it is so important that they were not letting me rest, they were not letting me do anything else until I got this video out there, so here I am. And I feel like it's going to resonate mostly for those of you who are in Divine Soulmate Connections, but it is definitely, definitely not limited to that. It can be for any type of a connection, um, even just a friendship, a relative, anybody okay it's if this doesn't resonate for you if you feel like this message is not for you please at least keep an open mind that it is meant for somebody so leaving a nasty comment is just not going to help anything like it's pointless please don't do that okay thank you and so yeah let's get on with this message like i said it's not anything new but i feel like right now a lot of you are being called to help out a specific person in the 5D. Now, for, for some of you, all right, not all of you, I'm gonna try to just get to some, some types of, uh, or groups of people, okay? Definitely cannot touch on everybody, but for a lot of you, you um, will have been in a cycle in the past or at a in a phase where you had the opportunity to help this person out in the 3D, okay? And you did help them, you were helping them. Um, and there was a reason for that, all right? You did, you were able to help them, not only for them, but there was also something in it for you. You know, there were lessons that you got out of it. That, and you feel like that cycle is done. Now, again, some of you feel like it's done and you are done with it, like, like that's it. And then for others of you, you're still putting energy into that. If you are still putting energy into that and you feel like it's pointless, yeah, it is pointless, all right? That's going to be wasted energy. So what the message here is for, for you, regardless of which group of people you're in, is that this cycle is done, okay? And how will you know? You will know because you will be getting different signs, okay? You might be feeling it intuitively. You might be getting different signs letting you know that this is done, like stop helping this person. Or, um, you know, there might be certain barriers that are presenting themselves that are preventing you from even being able to interact with this person, for example, or you're just b being pushed away in some way or another, or you just feel intuitively like, you know, um, anything I do or say is going to be pointless. So if this is the case for you, let me just validate that for you. All right. There is nothing absolutely nothing else that you can do in the 3D to help out this person or this situation. Nothing. It's done. Okay. Cycle complete. Done. Nothing else you can do. Anything you do from this point onwards is going to be wasted energy. Now, the important part of this message is that you, however, may be being called to help out this person in the 5D. So, Again, different types of situations here. Some of you might already be doing that. Great, you know, take this as validation or encouragement to keep doing that, all right, if you weren't sure about it. Um, for others of you, you've been, you, you feel something bubbling up. You're not sure what it is because you feel like you're done with this person, but there's just something, something there, and you feel like you're being called to do something, and, you know, this might make sense for you. Yes, you are being called to help out this person in the 5D, um, and for others of you, you, you know, like I said, you might still be putting energy in the 3D, but you feel like it's done. Yeah. Okay. This message might be for you as well. It's time to stop that and start helping this person in the 5D because there is nothing else you can do in the 3D. Okay. To help out this person. Now, um, does this mean that it is going to take you a step back? Does it mean that you are still attached? Does it mean that, I don't know, it's going to inhibit you from moving on or from moving forward? No, no, 
it could. I mean, for some of you, if you're not in this group that I am addressing, then yeah. Um, but if you feel like this is for you and that you are at this point where you are being called to do something and you don't know, you, you're just doubting yourself, then no, it's not going to help. It's not going to keep you back. All right. Now, is it necessarily going to bring about a result or is this other person that you are helping? Is it, are they going to do something about it and take advantage of this assistance? Not necessarily, but it doesn't matter. This is just a soul being called to help out another soul regardless of what happens next, okay? You do your part, and then whether they do their part or not is on them. It has nothing to do with you, okay? Um, oh, I'm being guided to say this too, that... And again, it's not going to, this isn't going to be true for all of you, but for a lot of you that this is going to resonate for, you have been through a phase where you feel like, like you were detaching and that you were moving on and you are past that phase of you, of using self-defense mechanisms to get past this. Okay. Where you may have been blocking out this person completely, the, the energy from you so that you could protect yourself, so that you could protect your heart, okay? And that's okay. That's okay too that, that, that you went through that phase or even if you're still in that phase, if you are at least aware of the fact that you are using a self-defense mechanism to help you through this, okay, you, you are still on the right path. All right, and you still could be being called to help out this person in the 5D. And if you are, you know, your soul is not going to be able to rest. You're, you're not going to be able to find peace until you actually do so. And then you can just, you know, go back to whatever it is you were doing, you know, continue living your life and, and moving forward. All right. And I cannot stress this enough how important it is if you're feeling called to do that, that you do so. Again, I was avoiding making this video and then, and I, I had already been called to do this and I did. And it happened like very spontaneously. It was almost as if I wasn't giving a, given a choice. And then the, right the next day, like something so profound happened that it, it just validated this. Like, it, it, like it was just crazy. I wish I could get into the details, but unfortunately I can't. Um, it's very personal and, um, there are people who watch my videos that I, I just, I just can't, I can't get into this stuff, but trust me when I say it's something very profound happened. And this is actually the reason why I'm even here making this video, um, for you guys, because it is very important, even if it's not new, because some of you have not been acting on it. And if you're feeling guided to take this as that final message to push you to, to do so. If you are, again, feeling guided to, all right, if you feel like this is making sense for you, it's not going to take you a step back. It does not mean that you are attached. It does not mean that then you can't move forward. No, if anything, it's going to help you to move forward because then you can just relax. <laughs> you know, you do what you feel called to do and then you can move on. Um, yeah, so again, and again, it might not, you know why this is actually going to work for you guys because you are not going to be coming from a place of lack or a place of um, fear or a place of insecurity if you're at this point, okay? And that's exactly why it's going to work and that is exactly why you're being called to do this at this particular point in time. And also because universally right now is a period in time where people are more receptive, okay, to different messages and to different energies. And so this is the perfect time for you to be able to help somebody else in the 5D and this is why you're being called to do so at this particular point in time, okay? Um, you are not doing this as a means to an end and that is exactly why it can work regardless of whether that person takes that opportunity, accepts that help and actually does something with it. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. You do you and then let them do whatever it is that they're going to do, okay? So for some of you who have already been doing this or for some of you who already know how to go about doing this, you know, that's great, fine, you know. But for those of you who 
feel like you need a little bit more guidance, um, the best that I can tell you right now is, you know, to get yourself into a high vibrational state, do anything that makes you feel good, you know, whether that be taking a hot salt bath, meditating, just something that is going to make you feel good, but also very relaxed at the same time to a point where you feel like you can connect with this person. Okay. So connect your energy with this person's energy, open up your heart chakra, send them love. All right. Um, let them know that you still believe in them. It does not mean that you, that you're stating anything about what you believe will happen in the future. That's a different thing. Your belief about the result, but you believe in them and that they have what it takes to do whatever it is that they are being called to do. All right. What is it that the, their own soul wants them to do? You believe in them for doing what their soul wants, not for a specific outcome, okay? Um, your opinion has nothing to do with this. It's all about you believing in them to be strong, to find that strength that they already have within them, okay? Send them that strength. Let them know that they are strong. They don't even need to have strength sent to them because they are strong enough to do whatever it is that they are meant to do. Let them know that they are worthy. Let them know that they are deserving. Let them know that they can have whatever it is that they are meant to have. Okay? They can have whatever makes them happy and whatever it is that their soul wants for them. Okay? Nothing that has to do with your opinion or with what you would want. And if you're at this point anyway, like, you wouldn't do that anyway. <laughs> Plain and simple. All right? So... Um, if you don't feel like you're at this point, you know, there are different, several different things that could be um, happening. For example, you know, maybe this just isn't your situation to begin with, number one. Number two, you might be in a different phase. It does not mean that you are behind or ahead of anybody else. It's just different phases. Um, you know, like you might be in a phase where, you know, your 3D effort might still be having some kind of an effect. Or you might be past all of this and then being called back to helping out in the 3D for whatever reason, okay? Every situation is different. You have to do what, you know, feels right for you. And um, some of you might not want to occupy yourself at all with this person. Well, you know, again, you know, do whatever you feel is in your highest good, all right? This was just the message that I felt very aggressively, actually, Um push to get out there because a lot of you need to hear that and as I said I had validation for it and even from somebody else and it's just crazy so there was a reason for it take it if it resonates um, disregard whatever does not make sense for you and yeah let me know definitely let me know in the comments if this resonated if this resonated for you let me know your thoughts all right in the comments give me a thumbs up let me know if you have any questions and I'm going to try to get more of these videos out there for you um, as my guides push me to do so. And I am sending so much love to everybody and I love you guys. Bye.